Hello, it's Black Mesa time again. Alright, Black Mesa time, boys. Encoding overloading. Encoding overloaded. No! This will just be a little loud. I'm just testing if this is the right mic. Alright, that's the right mic. Now, hopefully it doesn't hear what I'm saying for the next second. It's working. Alright. Black Mesa, we have hostile time. I have to continue this fucking level. Never mind, never mind. Why are you a security guard? Got you. Thank you. Something is comforting. <coughs> Something is comforting about this guy's voice line. I mean, especially after this fucking level. Where do I go? Oh, this way, right? Blast pit. Oh, this level is so difficult. Anyway, we're fine. Anyway, a way to take out this guard, or this bullshit, is to just jump down. I fucked up, but whatever. You? You probably won't. Don't.
So they, I, I think there's like more than one way to get this part done. Uh, it's actually really cool. It's what I like about Black Mesa. So you can take that elevator down, or you can do something in defense. Or maybe it's just supplies. I can't remember if the vents count as an actual way down. Yeah, they do. Alright, there we go. Hold on, gotta look around here. Wow. That's interesting. So now you can just set this to max speed. <coughs> Run over the hound eyes. And then you jump off. Not like that, but whatever. You then jump over here. So here's this radioactive material shit. I really like it in this game. It looks frickin' cool. Black Mesa is just perfect. Or at least I think it's pretty good. So, if you listen, 
There's a bull squid. I'm just gonna do this. Bull squid in this game is pretty creepy, eh? Where is he? Aha! Grenades! Fine then. I'll waste all my good MP5 ammo on him. You happy now, Black Mesa? Thanks. So here's some suit and uh, health recharge. Oh boy. If you really want to, you can just take care of that singular bull squid. Or you can take care of both bull squids. Both bull squids is safer, one bull squid is easier, and wastes less ammo. So. Wait. What was that noise? I swear to god, somewhere in the woods, there's, like, another bull squid, like, in this area. Loading zones. Fucking hell. So you'll start to wonder what that noise was, or is. Let's feed him to this barnacle. We already have enough dead bodies in this for one thing. Whatever.
Don't get too close to that guy. So now he can hear you walk. Yeah. I'll go shut the power on. So he hears you if you crouch. Which is, you know, great. Fuck. So, you have to get rid of the... Also, I'm kind of curious. What does this fucker look like on Matt Fulbright? That's disappointing. I wanted him to look horrible. Yeah. Yeah. So we're trying to go to the top one first, because we can actually drop down to the bottom one. Save. Uh, there we go. Oh my god, get in! We're fine, we're fine. Only lost, like, half of our fucking health. That guy's a real asshole. Bull squid, too. So now we're all good. Feed the things to the barnacle. This door won't fucking open, but whatever. Eh, don't worry about him. You can just crawl down here normally without killing them. So we have to engage both the fuel and the power. Woo! Oh my god, where? Fuck. I'm gonna have to do Matt Fulbright if I want to find that bull squid.
That goes a lot of my health. Let me just kill myself so that I have so that I can restart that section. Now we can make a quick save. See, that's a lot less health we lost. Alright, I can kind of see where I'm going here. I like that ambience. Whoever the hell made the the soundtrack for this game, actually, yeah, his name is Joel Nielsen, but whatever. That guy's a great guy. Anyway, we have to look here for more supplies, cause I, cause as you can see, my health isn't too peach keen. That's not health. I mean, yeah, it's supplies. I guess I can take ammunition. I can't see where I'm going. This is what Black Mesa does wrong. Black Mesa does a lot of things right, sure, but also does a lot of things wrong. You see what I mean? Here we go. So we turn this fan on. Oh, you have to be fucking kidding me. How did that count? So now we're in this vent.
right? So I think there's a health kit in here. I saw a suit battery, which, you know, great. There you are. Right. And then we have to walk past the barnacle tongue. Get over here. And now we're all good. We set the fuel system up. Meaning now we have to go back downstairs and do the power system. Which is a lot easier because we no longer have to go through that big guy's area. And I had my audio off the whole fucking time. Who would have guessed? Don't worry about it. Oh, fuck. I've never been caught by a barnacle before in this game. Like, I mean, not like that, obviously. Sometimes I've just walked into one on purpose to kill it and go up and crowbar it, but never have I ever done that, so, wow. So now, instead of going through the big guy's chamber, this is what we do. And we break this wood because we don't want it. Yeah. I wish you could do this in the original Half-Life. Ah, uh, that's just why Black Mace is better. Kidding. Wow. Wasted all my ammo. It doesn't give me enough ammo for, like, 9mm weapons. Nine mm ammo, nine millimeter ammo. Where are you? Get over here now. I'm low on nine millimeter ammo. All right, sorry guys. Well, actually, we kind of have to use our shotgun here because there's a vortigaunt, a few vortigaunts, I should say. Actually, never mind, there are hound eyes instead. I think in the original Half Life there are Vortigaunts. Whatever. It's all fine. Well, I mean. Health works. Like. You didn't hear that? Global ass. Are you guys alive? No. Yeah. Freight elevator. So let me just show you something, a cool trick I learned. Oh my god.
So, if you go on top of the elevator, and then down here, you can skip the elevator ride. Pretty funny, eh? Very, very helpful. Family Guy death pose for scientists, Half-Life mod. So now we turn on the power, and then we can go back upstairs and kill that little bitch. Oh! I didn't know he was so close to me. I thought it would just be an unsuspecting tyrant. Anyway, that's one half of the generator turned on. Time to get to the other half. This is Smithers. I won't. See, so you can easily kill that barnacle now. But yeah, now we have the power generator on. I really like the soundtrack for this game, I do. I just like this game in general. Black Mesa is amazing. Black Mazing. Those are the Vortigaunts I was looking for. No! No, god damn it. Funnily enough, never mind. I thought I could turn it on, that would have been funnier. But alas, this game isn't really that good. Original Half Life is better. You could do that in the original Half Life. Game probably also patched bunny hopping. Didn't it actually? I think it did patch bunny hopping. 
Anyway, that's really stupid. You also can't prop fly in it. Although you can't prop fly in original Half-Life, so that's not a point taken off. Anyway, guys, now that we have both of our systems engaged, it's time to kill the beast. So yeah, it's it's really cool how this was like in the lore a Cold War missile silo facility. Sorry, I didn't know that that was a platform. This is just another example of the soundtrack being amazing. Oh my god. I almost didn't see that. Run. Run. God damn it. Bye bye. Hell yeah. I'm not going anywhere. All right, I'll hold down this spot. Fuck you. Anyway, thanks, boy. Give me a high five. I sure hope there ain't more of those things growing around the base. <sighs> anyway, I guess that counts as a high five, repeatedly talking to him and looking at his hand. So. Wow. Blast Pit is really good in this game. We're just gonna get to the very beginning of Power Up. Here it is. Oh my god. The revolver in this game. It's so good. I always died at this part because I thought you had to ride one of those barrels. Anyway, I probably just missed a giant health pack. There it is, right there. And I didn't even take any fall damage getting to it.
Isn't this, like, radioactive waste supposed to be kind of bright? Checkmate source engine. And then you do this. And then... Get over here. I used to think that was a child laughing when I first played the game. But yeah, now we have tripwires. Glenn Craigmire. Oh. Anyway, it's been fun, boys, but I gotta go.